did Atlantis really exist? Hmm. Which is the earliest surviving reference to Atlantis, puts it this way, that his ancestor Solon visited Egypt. And we know about that visit. It's historically recorded. That visit to Egypt was in 600 BC. Yo, and there this kind of shit always used to interest me. Like before the times of the times that we know, you know, the, re the basic, well, yeah, the, the, the recorded history of, you know, What's how American history is really? It starts as, as slavery, then the shit just goes into some whole other shit. The the revolution, well, the Revolution of War and all these other things and all that. But I'm talking about before then, before we had the the civilization that we we have built since then. Like shit like this, shit about the Greeks and the Lances and all. Like I like shit because that was that's that was history before, I guess. The history that we we speak about in textbooks today. Solon claimed to have been told by Egyptian priests about this great advanced civilization that once existed, but that angered the gods and was destroyed in an enormous flood. And Solon asked those Egyptian priests, when did this happen? And they said, oh, 9,000 years ago. That's 11,600 years ago. And it's exactly the date of what is called Meltwater Pulse 1B, one of the biggest single rises overnight in sea level that ever occurred. So if Plato made it up, it's really weird that he... So basically he's insinuating that we indeed had an Atlantis, but it was flooded to... Uh, they said the gods, but I, we're going to just maybe hypothetically say natural causes, because I'm pretty sure that's a natural... Not natural, but it's... <sighs> picked a date that is precisely a date that coincides with the latest geological evidence on cataclysmic sea level rise at the end of the ice age. The end of the ice age. So when all the snow melts it. This is interesting. I don't really know that much about Solomon and all these other guys, but Atlantis was actually real at, at one point. Hmm. Hmm. What y'all think about this? Let's read these comments. So we're gonna say 1895. Hmm. Okay, I guess that's the video. The more we learn, the more actually. Yeah. Excuse me. And that's exactly why I like hearing about and reading about some of this stuff because it's like I wouldn't know no shit. Like, even though I may not, it's not gonna be brought up in conversation, but it's very important to know history. History is knowledge, bro. Knowledge in general is very good to have, bro. Very fucking good, bro. I don't know. Exact date. No ass into the chat. Hey yo. Check and go. <laughs> That's mad funny. But uh yeah, y'all let me know if y'all if y'all believe in this, if this was actually accurate, or if y'all know y'all actually have specific information or specific uh research done re specific research on this kind of thing, man. It's very interesting.